and we're getting better at real fighting, so now I'm going to teach you something else that's really important. This is the action gauge. Yeah, I know that already. Come on, just listen. Up until now, your action gauge has only gone down when you're actually doing something, right? But from now on, as soon as you make your first move, your action gauge will just keep going down no matter what. Huh? What does that mean? What it means is that even when you're standing still, time will keep on passing. If you're not paying attention, your turn will be over before you know it, and it'll be your enemy's turn. What? That's no fair. Fighting like that's gonna be really, really hard. Yep, that's right. And that's where tactical time comes in. Tactical time? What's that? Tactical time is the time you get at the beginning of your turn to figure out what it is you're gonna do. As long as you don't move or attack, you can stay in tactical time for as long as you want. Okay, so then what you're saying is, the tactical time you get is unlimited, and that would mean... Oh, I get it. So when it's your turn, all you have to do is stay standing still, and then you have lots of time to think about what you're gonna do when you start fighting. Exactly. One more thing. From now on, the more echoes you build up, the more power your special attacks will have when they hit an enemy. Echoes? An echo is what you get when your hit count reaches a certain number, and they just keep accumulating, right over here. Oh, I get it. In that case, we should just use our special attacks all the time. That way, we'll be building up lots and lots of echoes, and our special attacks will just keep getting stronger and stronger because we'll have so many echoes. It's perfect! We'll be killing two birds with one stone. I am so smart! Not so fast. Unfortunately, when you use your special attacks, all the echoes you've accumulated get used up. Basically, the power of your special attack increases, but you lose all of your echoes because of it. So, if you want to try and build up a lot of echoes, you can't do it by using your special attacks. Oh, but how can you ever get enough echoes to use them with your special attacks? It must be really hard for one person to build up so many all by himself. That's right, and that's why we have to work together to build them up. Echoes don't just belong to you, they belong to everyone who's fighting. But then that means that you could use up all the echoes that I had worked so hard to build up. That doesn't sound very fair, you know. Come on, don't say things like that. I'm counting on you, partner. Beat! Look over there at that enemy! What about it? How did that happen? It just turned into a completely different monster! There are some monsters that can transform, depending on whether they're in sunlight or in shadow. Some will get really strong, and some will even change the kinds of attacks they use, so you gotta be really careful. Wash yourself. 
yourself up! Go around. Wow. 